Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World The Game. Yes, not too long ago, well I made quite a few videos recently of the new hybrid coming which is the first ever aquatic hybrid and it is finally here, the Dunkelosaurus, a hybrid between Mosasaurus and Dunkelosaurus. For the longest time we thought that Mosasaurus was going to be hybridized with the Megalodon. The Megalodon. The me what, what does Jason Statham say? Megalodon. The Megalodon. <laughs> but no, it turns out that uh, it's... Oh, hold on. Uh, what, what, if you don't like flashes, turn away two seconds. Uh, there you go. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, there, there it is. Uh, whew, pesky. Go away. Right. Um, so, yeah, we thought it was going to be Megalodon for the longest time, making a, a Megalomosa, Megalosaurus, or... Well, I guess that would make sense. A Moselodon, or something like that. But it's, it turns out to be Dunkelostius. Um... And I actually, it, there was, I thought for, it was, yeah, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about. Um, there was an update on uh, Jurassic World, the game's uh, Instagram page that said, look out next week. And it had the, a really old promotional image, I'll probably throw it up, um, of the Mosasaurus. Like when it was first being released and teased, it was like back years ago when we were first getting um, aquatic creatures being put into this game, when there was loads of hype around it. Um, they showed that image, and I, I just remember it so vividly that the, the gem of the uh, yellow eye, and for some reason they're using it again for this one? Um, or maybe they just didn't have one ready. Uh, oh, thank goodness. I love me a level 30 now, so um, I was going to say I can start working towards um, the Dilophosaurus level 40, but I'm probably going to need to possibly get that uh, Dunkelosius and Mosasaur hybrid. So this, oh, 2077 health and 1,269 attack. Hell yeah, this thing's awesome. Okay, um, this is so much excitement. It's so good, isn't it? Uh, I, I've actually been really enjoying playing this game recently because when I've been, you know, grinding tournaments or what, what have you, or just playing it generally, every now and again in the background, I'll get a code 19. And you'll know by now, that means that, the, you know, you need to go through some little mini game to stop a dinosaur from escaping. But at the same time, that allows you to get the, oh, the, the holy grails, which are the super DNAs. And at the moment, I think it's just Velociraptor that uh, you can get in those code 19s. But it just, it just adds something to do rather than just sitting and grinding. It's like, ooh, look, something new. Or, you know, something's came up. Um, I don't know what happens if you ignore the code 19s. Maybe the dinosaur just escapes normally. I don't know. Uh, Six million food for 2,000. Yeah, why not, I suppose. Uh, ooh, one of those for 240. Uh, probably not worth it, but I'll do it anyway. Uh, and every day... Um, I am just selling gold for, uh, bucks. So I sell about 2 million gold for 100 bucks. And, you know, if, te if I do that for a week, that is 3 times 7, which is 21 times that by 10. So it's 2,100 bucks a week I can get if I just keep doing that. So, yes, I'll, I mean, I, you have, if, if you're not in the state that I'm in, where, you know, uh, you don't have loads of creatures to get gold, that's going to be really hard for you to maintain. Uh, and because we have the hybrid, of course, we have a discount of loads of aquatic creatures up to, t uh, well, 10% discount. So if I really want to, I could buy um, the Mosasaurus again. Um, but there's no real point because I've already got it. Um, so I think there's going to be a tournament coming. It might even be here now. Um, no, no tournament so far of the Mosasaurus. So only people who have managed to get the Mosasaurus in the first ever tournament. I think that maybe it was the second one. Was there a second one? Was there two? Has there been two Mosasaur tournaments? Uh, I know there's definitely been one because I, I stayed up for 72 hours straight almost to get the Mosasaurus. Didn't sleep, just kept on playing it. And finally, that same Mosasaurus was fused together in here to make this one. And now for the first time in Jurassic World The Game history, we are going to make an aquatic hybrid. Fusing together a level 40 Dunkelosteus and a level 40 Mosasaurus. Pros and cons? Pros, this is going to be the strongest creature aquatic in the game and... Probably it's gonna be up there. I've got to admit a tournament creature and a legendary creature will make for something really strong in general 
Um, but at the same time, we're probably going to be facing much harder opponents. I have barely had any chance to acknowledge or uh, appreciate the uh, change that the Mosasaur has given to my team uh, doing aquatic battles. And now I'm going to lose it for this thing. But 500 bucks, 80 speed up. Are you ready? And it, okay. I think in this episode, what we're going to do is we're going to get the um, the Mosalosaurus, whatever you want to call it. And in a, another episode, we'll max it. If you really want this maxed up, guys, leave a like, leave the cut, you, you know, all, all those things, all those things that YouTubers get you to do. That, that way I'll, because it's going to be a lot of books and it's going to be a lot of DNA for me to get this um, to level 40. So I need to know that you really, really want this. <laughs> Something we both want together. So, ooh, okay, this is the first time we've seen the hybrid chamber for the aquatics. So, it appears to be a Mosasaurus, basically. Just with a thick outer shell or uh, armored plating on the outside. Dunkelosaurus is now available to purchase in the dinosaur market. So, you know, with 10% off. Oh, there it is! <gasps> it looks so cool! I mean, it actually looks kind of chubby because <laughs> it's got that, like, excess chub that the uh, the Dunkelosteus has. Ooh, I like it. I mean, at level one, it has 1,245 health and 649 attack. And there it goes. Oh, man, this brings back so many memories. I remember when, like, the aquatic creatures were first put into the game, and I was like, oh, that looks so cool, just being underwater, seeing, like, especially even animating. Um, like, animating underwater, you would think is quite easy, because the, uh, the hardship of animation is for uh, you to create the illusion of weight and gravity. Um, but it's, it's actually really hard to create the opposite, a realistic... Um, look at, uh, at water or like things to move in water and that's exactly what this is but anyway let's level it up oh god oh let's just see let's just see Rawr! oh there you go boosh there you go eat the shark yum 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 so we're gonna watch that one more time level 10 1868 health and 973 attack making it uh, I mean, obviously not as good as a VIP creature at level 40, but at level 20, it's gonna be on par. Almost the same health as Tylosaurus level 40. Not the same attack, probably half attack. So what do we get? What the little, the little tidbit of information? Though Dunkelosiosaurus may look like a fish, it actually has lizard DNA from its ancestor Mosasaurus. The strange thing is, even though this is, oh god, no, I lost it. Even though it is an aquatic creature and a cave creature, sorry, a surface, uh, unfortunately it is a surface. Uh, I mean, that was probably gonna happen. You couldn't have a cave creature have the Mosasaurus um, animation. Because if we go to a cave creature, um, they're all the way down in the depths, a different part of the lagoon. So, couldn't really have that, but, uh, you know, I understand it. Um, so, let's have a look. Oh, God, we got a card pack to get. Uh, oh, look at all that. Give us your money and we'll give you stuff that doesn't... It, it is not real. And it's all just digital. Ah, oh, fantastic. So, how much does this thing cost is the question. Oh, I have all of these in. Oh, fantastic. So, well, you know what? Let, yeah, let, here we go. Let's go in here. So, we want DNA cost first. Okay. Uh, it's probably going to be the first one then, right? You would assume. And it is... Oh, my God. What is with the scrolling in this game? It's so weird. Right. So, if Moses saw 7,000, I'm going to assume it's probably about 20,000. Maybe a little bit more. 61,000 and... Damn, is that a good-looking card. Look at that. looks awesome. That pose. The, the, uh, like the flow of motion there is beautiful. Um, so, 7,000. So, you you save 7,000 on it. So, I kind of have to buy it. I have to buy seven of them. So, therefore, seven times seven. Is that 40, 35? No, no, that's half. That's five times seven. So, it's like 40... 49? Is it 49? Something like that. 40, I would say 49,000. DNA. So obviously I can't afford that uh, even just to buy two of them. I can barely afford it. Uh, so it's something that's really expensive actually. Wow. Okay. Um, so now that this is a problem, I knew, I knew we were going to get to this stage. Um, so dinosaurs that I don't really need. We have the Serizinosaurus, which I already have level 40 and I have 10 more here. Um, 
and I can sell one for 24,000. So, if I wanted to, oh my god, how much? I mean, that's a hybrid. That's a legendary hybrid. Is it just me, or is it costing a lot more for the aquatics? Let's go for, uh-huh, and let's go for uh, rarity. How about that? That should make it first, right? Rarity? No, no, really? Still not first, okay. So 61,000, we have to sell three, two for six, and a little bit extra in order to afford one. We have 10, we can sell 10 and get possibly four with the leftovers. It is a shame because I do use the Severus and Asaurus when it comes to tournaments, just to grind them. Um, but it's really not, it's not giving me anything, if I've got to be honest. So we'll sell that one and can I just keep selling these ones? Yep, two, three, four, five, oh god, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. There you go. So, they were investments because I did buy them for like 20,000, so I was making 4,000 DNA profit. And I deliberately bought them for such an occasion that I would need them like this. Um, so, uh, that I'm going to have to do that. Um, so, we can... Just sort of speed these up. Again, that's a, a creature that I will be using. So we are making progress in the park. Um, I think that's going to be a level... I mean, it's a marsupial lion. It's a legendary. Um, I don't know if it'll have a hybrid. I'm not sure. I don't... Well, I mean, eventually it probably will. Um, so we'll go in here. We're going to... Uh, ooh, no, no, no. We'll go into not owned. Yeah. Aquatic. And we'll go... Well, it doesn't even make a difference because we just have to scroll to the end. We've got lots of dinosaurs that we do need to sell. So, 61,000. Can we just have a look? If we just go into dino mo dinosaur market and we go into hybrids and we go all the way, what costs 60 odd thousand? Um, so, something like Metrophodon. And that's with the nerf, the 10% discount I'm getting. So, we're looking at something that could be that good. I haven't even checked, actually. How good is Dunkelos uh, Moser Dun Dunkelosaurus at level 40. So we'll go to you. Uh, 6,900 health and 3,594 attack. It's a little bit of a rip-off just because a Metrophodon doesn't cost that much and is, you know, has an extra 1,500 attack. Yeah, it has one minus 1,500-ish health, but the attack is what makes it. But if you get this to level 40, by God, is that going to be worth it? So we'll pop you in there. Um, we'll go back to the Dino Marker. We'll buy another one, pop you in there. Uh, go back to the Dino Marker, pop you in there. Um, so that is one, two, three, four, including the one we got five. So we need six, seven, eight. We need three more. So we can technically buy one more. Um, all incubators are full. Well, that's fine. So we have one, two, three, four. Five, six. We need two more, so we need to get somehow another sixty-two thousand DNA um, in order to do this. I'm just wondering how much is it to speed up? Uh, one thousand six hundred. So we we need to get the free one twice, and then we can start working on it. Uh, so we need to make an extra sixty odd thousand DNA here. Uh, anything that could give us that extra sixty odd thousand? Well, we've already fused. Um, Indominus Rex to make Indoraptor, so I don't think there's any point having a level 10. Unfortunately, I have fed you. I know, I'm so sorry. 14,000. That really doesn't seem like much. Surely there's got to be more. There's got to be more creatures. Yeah, there we go. Sod all of you. 2,000, 2,000, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000. Microposaurus is an absolute waste. <laughs> so, hold on. That was 1,200, right? Oh, yeah, roll over. Get your belly tickled. 1,000 an odd. Oh, I was going to say, see if we could get more off in there. So now we, we've we got one extra. So we may as well speed that up for a lot of bucks. <laughs> Good lord. Okay, well, there's one. Um, would you go away, man. I'm trying to click this. Um, we'll go for aquatic hybrids. Hatch that. Then we go back into here. Buy another one. Now all we need is 50,000 DNA. So we've got to look at dinosaurs that... I mean, we could sell a lot, like, we could sell a lot of these, so like 1,000, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000, and, you know, may as well keep the 20 and the 30. 
Um, we'll have a look to see if any... Paggy Gallasaurus. I could, yeah, I could imagine having more of those. None of those either. Stuff like the Unicorn Wizard. Beautiful Unicorn Wizard. I'm, I'm sorry. Um, I, well, I can sell one. We can definitely sell one. Um... It does have a hybrid. Uh, Pytrodon. Level 30. 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, we can get level 40. I didn't even realize that. Okay. Um, that does only cost DNA. Nope, not you, not you. Uh, you guys, you know what? I, how much do you sell for? Like 5,000? Tani Colagrius. Um, or Tani Colagrius. So 1, 2, 3, 4. So we're getting there. Is there any more? Mastodonosaurus. We're level 40. Press sutures. Mastodonosaurus, one, two, three, four. Is that enough? 62, there we go. So that that is it. We have enough. Just scraped it together. I mean, if we really wanted to, we could probably uh, scrape together a little bit more. So that means we've got three, uh, three uh, actual ones created. Four, five, six. Uh, seven will be uh, this one. Actually, it'll already be in there, won't it? It should already be here. Hatch. And then the final one to be bought. Boom! There it is. We have done it. M M C Douglastius Mosasaur hybrid ready. Um, oh, I mean, we saved a whopping, was it 70,000 DNA in total with that 10% discount? So it's not too bad. Um, but with that said, how about we see what a level 20 looks like if once we watch the animation over again. Bah! Oh, beautiful. Oh, it looks so cool. Okay, so let's fuse it. Evolve. 140, 120. I am spending more bucks. It does seem to only get some color, but it's we're going to have a level 10 and a level 20 um, of this creature. Oh, come on. I've already spent all my bucks. Selling that Indominus Rex was all I had. Doing that event over and over, I should say. And here it is, a level 20 and health and stats. 2,421 health and 1,261 attack. So, level 10, level 20. Okay, so the underneath actually shows a little bit more of Dunkelostia's colors. Its top shell actually doesn't change. It's just the bottom. That's quite nice. So, they've actually went to the extent of not painting that bit and painting the underneath. Usually, when we see these creatures leveled up, it's the whole thing gets like a hue and saturation bump. Um, but that's quite nice that only that bit's changed. Ah, let's level it up to level 20 to 3,199 health and 1,666 attack. Making it one of the strongest creatures at level 20. And, I mean... Spoilers, it's the strongest creature. The strongest aquatic creature in the game. Um, so, ooh, let's have a look. What do we get? Little factoid, some more food. Uh, like the Mosasaurus, Dunkleosaurus breathes air and must surface to fill its lungs. So, can we have a look at what situation we can use this in? Not that one. And uh, not that one. And that that is actually unfortunately it. Uh, but we should have a PvP. Aquatic? Yeah, we have a PvP aquatic. So where does it stack? Ferocity doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Just put up rarity. Rarity makes sense. So it is in my top five. Um, just, I mean, out, it says just outbeating Bonogamous. But if you look at it, it's got double the health almost. With the same attack. So really, it should be even better than Hanotis. For some odd reason, Ferocity is completely messed up. Because apparently... It is, um, it's probably going to be all the way at the end. In fact, if I switched it, where even is it? What? Where? Level, is it here? No, not there either. Okay, so it's got to be at the top. It's hard to see what it is. There's the Mosasaur. We've got some Mosasaurs, level 10, level 10, level 9. I don't even remember having those. Um, I must have won them. So... Yeah, apart well, th there's there's Tylosaurus and there is Dunkelostius. Uh, sorry, the Dunkelosaurus. So rarity is probably the best way to stack them. Um, so it's really, really, really friggin' good. So what we're gonna do is just showcase this this bugger off. Um, can I not take? I'm clicking that. Can I not take out? Hello? Can I not? Once I. Whoa! I'm clicking that like there's no end. Oh my god, okay. Well, there we go. We'll have Dacosaurus, Dunkleosaurus, and Dacosaurus. And hopefully, we'll face up against an opponent that has dinosaurs that aren't as strong. Um, 
I really like this PvP arena. We don't see enough, or at least the draft. It's the draft arena. We don't really see too much. Okay, the Chronosaurus is the only thing really to worry about here. Is it? Oh no, this is just the regular battle arena. Um, yeah, the draft or what? What? It's not a draft arena anymore. It used to be drafts. Drafts were kicked out of the game as they were way too easy. Um, so here it comes, Dunkley or Mosul, whatever it's called. <laughs> <laughs> Dora the Explorer. So I'll go for two attacks just to make sure it's dead and one reserve. Oh, it looks so badass. It looks so good. Right, and it comes Maosaurus or, Ma or Mausaurus. Mausaurus, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I'm no paleontologist or Latin reader. So it goes for a regular hit, making it only have one block or one reserve. We've got four, so we can kill it in one, factor in that one extra, and honestly cave has a weakness to me so there's literally no point me to do anything else so what we'll do is we'll go for um it's full-on animation we'll go for a couple of blocks four reserves or two blocks and four reserves because it can't touch me although bless it it tries right so it's probably going to take me a while to get the uh this thing maxed up just because i don't want to speed up all those incubators and even then i've got to you know um i've got to speed it up uh, evolving it as well, so it's it's gonna take some time, so patience, patience, please. Uh, we will get there eventually, though. Uh, and let's see, it's full on eat animation, which will probably have it the same as the most. So, dragon, it's uh, it's teeth through the sound, the, the, yeah, it's teeth through the sand. I was gonna say lower jaw, I got completely confused in that sense. There, there you go, don't exactly know what that means, <laughs> but it's there. And yeah, there you go. So yeah, best creature, the best aquatic creature, new world record, <laughs> is the Dunkleosaurus. Uh, please, some books. I would love some, please don't be coin or food. Books, please. Books is what I want. No, no, <laughs> come on. Oh, well, there you go. And nope, nope, can't do it because I'll try and play a video and it won't work. So guys, that is going to have to wrap up this video um, of the Dunkleosaurus, whatever it's called. If you are lucky enough to have won the Mosasaur into a tournament, um, it's definitely worth it. Um, at level 20, I mean, you don't even need to spend all the DNA that I did um, because even at level 20, it's so, so good. It's up there. Uh, if you already have the Mosasaur, and sp you just have to spend like 60,000 bucks on buying it once and then you've got a, a dinosaur that can compare to the VIP creatures that you've already got. Uh, that you might have anyway at level f at level 40. At level 20, it's on par with level 40. So anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye